Hey, Gwen, thanks again for fast tracking those. Okay. Wait, what? Hi, Carla. Thanks for coming in on such short notice. Oh, no problem, Miss B. I won't be too long, Brett. Okay. Uh, you brought Brittany? I had no choice. She gets anxiety attacks sometimes, and I have to pull her out of school. Mr. Shears and his lawyer have arrived. Oh, hey, Britt. Hey, Dad. Rough morning? Yep. Finnegan's awake. I found the idiosyncratic language tedious. English assignment? No. Pleasure. The results of your DNA tests came back. Dwayne is not Brittany's father. Guilty as charged. I'm not done. You're not Brittany's father, but Carla, you're not Brittany's mother. This makes no sense. You're definitely pregnant. You got as big as a barn. Thank you, Dwayne. Where was Brittany born? St. Patrick's. Walk me through it, you remember. It was a crazy night. A nurse told me it was nine months to the day after that terrible storm. The one that caused the blackout. Couldn't watch wrestling, so, uh... Okay, fast forward to a mini baby boom. Um, four of us had to share a room. I needed a C-section, so my, my memories are foggy after that. What do you remember, Dwayne? Uh, Brittany and another baby were taken away to go under some lamp thingy because they were yellow. Uh, they were brought back a little while later. The other kid belonged to the lady, the one that was bitching because she paid for a private room. Oh, her, yeah. She didn't even want an epidural. Oh, what a dum-dum. Okay, leave it with me, all right? We're gonna get to the bottom of this. Dwayne, we can't breathe a word of this to Brittany, eh? Not yet. You really think this girl could have been switched to birth? Can that even happen these days? There was a case recently out of Tennessee. If you get the perfect storm of understaffing, overwork, and incompetence. Cecil, I'll need you to subpoena the birth records and room assignments for the night Brittany was born. Yep. Sure thing, just as soon as I finish my sandwich. <clears throat> that poor girl. I've read about cases like this. The children often wind up feeling like they don't belong in either family. When I was a kid, I convinced myself I was switched at birth and Tony Danza and Judith Light were my real parents. Who's the boss? A, O, O, A. Does anyone here ever work? Harry. Harry. I just want to apologize for assuming the breakup was your fault. <laughs>